Jackknife Semi causing issues along 80. Yeah, uh, we want to go to Brian Hickey now to talk more about the traffic and what he's seeing out there. Brian, you were at one location and now you're at a different location. A lot going on out there on the roads this morning. Yeah, so I just want to clear that up. There was a big rig that jackknifed last night that led to the closure of Interstate 80. That was down at the Farad exit. They finally cleared that one, got traffic moving. We were on our way back toward Sacramento and came across this one. This one is at the Floriston exit, literally maybe a mile and a half up the road from the other jackknife big rig. And this is now the fourth big rig to jackknife in this area in just over 24 hours. So there's something going on here. One person reported the road was very slick in this area. Obviously it's wet, but to have four jackknife big rigs in the same area in a short time span is uh, clearly an issue and a, a problem for drivers. As you can see the backup here on eastbound Interstate 80. So if you are coming down through this area, just use caution. Really give yourself some extra time. As you can see, the big rig tow truck is here, and once they start to pull that truck and trailer straight, they'll likely have to shut the freeway down again to uh, get that all straightened out and then get that truck off the freeway here right at the uh, Floriston on an off ramp here along eastbound Interstate 80. But again, pretty wet up here, chilly, slick roads, four big rigs now, jackknife in this area. So just use caution coming through the Sierra. I'm Brian Hickey, KCRA 3 News.